So I was thinking like like normally we should first start with you guys and talk with you about something if you have any questions, anything at all that you want me to respond to, talk about or or like anything like that. Um, we're gonna do it. I'm gonna talk to you guys. You guys can ask me questions and then we're gonna get jump into the blind auction winner. And after that, we are probably go gonna go into the game itself. So, uh, fishing broke. It should be fixed. It is fixed. It is fixed, Emihana. You should go and test it. Um, probably shouldn't mention what it was, but... Top drone. Hey, Jake. Not sure if it is still there still or not, but did you already remove the Boninator mask? Yes, we removed it, like, within one hour from the update. We removed it immediately. Uh, so you can still see that in the booster, but you cannot get it. So that's how it works. Because if we would remove it from your local device so it wouldn't show the graphics over there, uh, yeah, we would have to just do 100% completely new update for it. And we just, what's the point for doing just small graphical bug? Uh, you cannot get, get that Bunninator mask from, from that booster and haven't been able since like one hour up from the update or something. Hey Jake, why are all dynamic worlds owned by Commander K? Not you, Dev, or Endless. Uh, it's just for it's just a tradition, more or less. Uh, do, 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 do. Any news on the influencer program? Well, I'm gonna talk a little bit about it today, well, not on the live stream, but after the live stream, because I'm having a small uh, conversation with with Commander K, for example. <coughs> but um, yeah, hopefully. I will get it done like next week or something. Like, look at this. So, like, I want, I don't want to listen to you. I just want to be po pointing to the sky. <laughs> How was the survey? Were there any good ideas from the players? Mr. Edison, I personally don't look at them um, in their rough format. So, um,. One developer from us is, I'm not going to mention any names, is going to be taking a look at them and uh, creating an analysis of it and uh, pulling up all the interesting things and suggestions and everything and uh, then it is going to represent us, to, like the whole team at the same time. So that's how we work and that's how we can save some time, not so that everybody just goes through them by themselves. So um, yeah, so I haven't seen that. Uh, do you look at the PW Suggestions channel on the Pixel Watch Discord? Bernard Seller, we we look at it. I'm gonna put it like that. We always pull uh, ideas from there to add to our suggestion list. We have our own personal suggestion list um, in the internet. <laughs> well, I've always said like here in the office, but it's not at the office. It's on the servers, uh, on our work servers where we add new suggestions and then when we need to create or get some ideas or, or think like, hey, let's pull something that community would like, then we go into the suggestions and we read different suggestions and then choose what we want to do. Uh, I can't see Bunny Ray said in Pixel Walls Exchange. Still can't see. Pixel Walls Exchange, the Bunny Ray. Oh, Bunny Ray. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's not there. It, it, it is not there. We forgot to add it there. And you will not get it there until the next update, and that's going to be happening in May. Unfortunately. Will, will be the, the next devlog. Uh, when I have something cool to show you, um, then it's going to be... Most likely, I plan to have them like two or three weeks apart. So last week, last week Saturday was the first one, so I would say like maybe maybe next week on the or one week after that. Although we have some Easter holidays and I'm planning to have some holiday time, so uh, I, I would probably say three or f well, maybe three weeks from now, maybe. Mm, we want more ways to earn gems. How many more ways to, ways to earn gems do pe people want until they realize that they also need somewhere to spend them? That's a really good point, Gargoyle. That's a really good point. Um, and of course, like for new players, there might be a lot of ways to and a lot of places to put gems into. But for veteran players, it might actually be a little bit problematic sometimes. Uh, you might have hundreds of thousands of gems and you're like, well, yeah, I, maybe I could buy the... Um, if I can find the... Um, 
like dark cherub wings or dark pixie wings somewhere. Maybe I could buy that, but for that I would need like 20 million gems or something like that. So we're not even close, but there is nothing for me at this moment. Uh, there are things like this. And uh, for hopefully in the future we would have uh, like places... Because if you want to farm, uh, you wouldn't first like... What's point of creating new farming features if you have no places where to put the gems to? Or places you would want to put the gems to? Of course, that's a problematic thing, and um, that's why uh, the, one of the things would be the card game that is coming out in two months. Approximately two months, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully two months! But I will keep you updated, yeah. When did the Pixel Worlds uh, VIP Pixel Worlds provision change many times? It was 1% yesterday, and now it is 5%. Nico Capel, because there was a... <laughs> it wasn't meant to be 1%. <laughs> It wasn't meant to be 1%, that's why. <laughs> you guys got some extra... Uh, extra uh, free provision thing. <laughs> and it wasn't 1%, it was one byte coin, by the way. So it was zero. <laughs> the provision for VIP players was zero. Uh, but yeah. And it was only one byte coin. But yeah, now it should be 5%. Where does our taxes go? <laughs> Your taxes go to to the retirement fund of of of, of nether, nether vendor. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Lower our taxes, please, Kexian. You have to get some VIP time from Fine Jake or from the stream, the, like right now, if you have enough points to to reduce it by five percent. But yeah, um. There are two reasons why we did it. Uh, change the like the commission a little bit or taxes. Um, first, it's just to take care of the co like the community and economy of the game, and that is actually a really big thing. Uh, and the other thing was to then buff a VIP because VIP truly needs some buffing. Uh, yeah. Uh, mass drop, Apollyon. This is a little bit problematic because. Yeah, cool that you could do mass drop, but, for example, you cannot drop 100 items into the same location. You cannot do that, like, physically. Uh, there's not enough space in the ground for that. Uh, and uh, then what if you accidentally do that and then play each every player takes your items and then you're, like, sending me messages like, Oh, I dropped everything and people scammed all my items from my inventory because they said to press this button that drops everything. Like, no. <laughs> uh, will there be a public test server? PTS. I don't know, at least for now, no. Like, we want to at least keep something, se some secrets from you guys. And Thanks for saying that would limit people now hate me. We, we would have to first, like, make them swear or, like, write some, uh, what do you call it, confidentiality agreements and everything. It's too much hassle, and it would take us too much time. <laughs> Storage machine that's even better than Quantum Safe with 100 slots. Maybe we could do something about it or something like that, but I don't think 100% slots. The problem with that is, is it that it is too uh, demanding from your device. So for some mobile players, the moment you open it, your device would crash because you're out of memory on your device. Uh, so, so that's probably why. That's one of the reasons. Or the they won't wouldn't work. They would be lagging just because you don't have enough processing power in your PC or like your mobile phone. PC in PC, this is not a problem. 